Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Alif Lam Mi Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Dan yurin Quran Masya Allah Alaikum assalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My dear son Dad Dad I have a question You always say that every single day is the best day But isn't there days that are the most blessed days that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentions in the Quran? Excellent question, my dear son. The reason why I always say that every single day is the best because Allah is always there guiding us to the right path. But my son, these first 10 days of Dhul Al-Hijjah are the best days out of the whole year. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, dad. So in the Quran, in Surah Al-Fajr, these 10 days are so blessed that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in these two ayat says Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Wal-Fajri wa layalin ashri Allah swears by the dawn and the 10 nights and Allah swearing shows how these 10 days of Dhul Al-Hijjah are so blessed These 10 days of Dhul Al-Hijjah are meant for fasting. But even though there are 10 days, the 10th day falls on the festival of Eid Al-Adha or the day of sacrifice. So we only fast for 9 days. Dad, I have another question. Dhul Al-Hijjah is not as blessed as Laylatul Qadr, right? Because Laylatul Qadr is far greater. Son, you're wrong because Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said that there are no days more beloved to Allah that he be worshipped in them than the 10 days of Dhul al-Hijjah. And every time you stand in prayer at night in Dhul al-Hijjah, it is equivalent to Laylatul Qadr. MashaAllah, Dad. But what is the reward? for fasting in Dhul al-Hijjah. My son, the reward is enormous. If you fast in Dhul al-Hijjah, it is as if you fasted for one whole year. And every time you do good deeds, Allah will increase his rewards by so much. Because in these 10 days, Allah loves your good deeds more than any day. Alhamdulillah. It's another opportunity to repent to Allah. May all of us go to Jannat al-Firdaus. Us, my son. Dhul al-Hijjah is the best. Allah is the most gracious and the most merciful.